lot more uh, comfortable sleeping weather, that's for sure. Yeah, you know, raking up to a lot of 50s out there, Patrick, including at Echo Lake in Pasco, where the skies have been mostly clear through the night. The temperature right now at a comfortable 57 degrees. We have a dry and cooler start to all across the area. 55 Smithfield, 59 this morning in Westerly and the temperatures in Newport are running right around uh, 60 degrees 57 New Bedford and as we take a look at our uh, live pinpoint Doppler 12 radar conditions dry no showers or storms another day with a low humidity and with high pressure and control it's our fair weather friend so that high as it's sitting off to our west will help to create this dome of dry air over the New England area and you can see the mostly clear skies both here in southern New England as well as northern New England just a few patchy clouds making their way into northern Vermont our future cast for today shows little in the way of cloud cover other than some fair weather cumulus clouds will likely develop. We've got uh, mostly clear starts should be a very comfortable morning for us in the afternoon. Lots of sunshine. Nice summer day if you can uh, make the most of it after work or school. Should be a nice evening to take a walk or maybe head to the beach for a few hours at 10 o'clock tonight. Sky's mostly clear. Now the humidity on the rise a bit through the overnight hours, so a little bit muggy through the night. And there may be a few patches of fog when you wake up on Friday morning. I don't think it'll be widespread or dense. We may see some of that Saturday morning, but uh, we'll watch for a little fog to start the day Friday by Friday afternoon, partly to mostly sunny sky and then a warm and a muggy finish to the work week. Mid 80s today though in Central Falls, beautiful east side downtown near 86. Lots of sunshine on the east and west bays where the temperatures will be in the middle 80s. Garden City, Riverside and Barrington along the south coast a little cooler today. We start off with a mostly northerly wind and we'll turn our winds more to the uh, southwest in the afternoon. So Newport about 81 for the high westerly at 82. Uh, we are warm and dry at the beaches about 81 for the air temperature. The water temperature running close to 70 degrees and the safe sun time will only be around 10 to 15 minutes with uh, the high UV index. In our northwest corner of the state, the temperatures will be in the middle 80s, warm and dry conditions there. Nice day. Southwest winds at 5 to 12 miles an hour in southeastern Mass. Another warm one, mid 80s, Fall River, New Bedford, Seekonk at about 85. On the bay today, good visibility, waves one foot or less. The high tides at four in the afternoon, low tide at about nine this morning. Take a look at the seven day future cast. So three more days of this uh, heat and humidity. We've got temperatures in the middle 80s. Thursday and again for your Friday afternoon. Saturday looks warm and muggy with temperatures in the lower 70s in the morning. I think we're still dry at lunchtime and then a chance of a shower or a thunderstorm by 3 o'clock in the afternoon. Be a both warm and very humid day Saturday, but then big changes on Sunday with a fallish feel of partly sunny and it looks dry for the afternoon hours. We may start off with a lingering shower at dawn, but that should quickly end and we'll see brighter skies as the day goes on. You can see those temperatures running cooler than average for Monday and on Tuesday. Some of our computer models are bringing in some uh, rain for Tuesday night and some showers on Wednesday. So we'll be keeping an eye on that for you. See if that does uh, take place a long way away though. Best chance of showers and storms again. This will be Saturday late in the day into Saturday night.